that day shall Yahuwah Sabaoth be for a crown of glory and for a diadem of beauty unto the remnant of his people. The Ruach Adoni Yahuwah is upon me because Yahuwah has anointed me to preach the Basura unto the meek. He has sent me to bind up the brokenhearted, to proclaim liberty to the captives, the recovery of sight to the blind, and the opening of the prison to them that are bound, to proclaim the acceptable year of Yahuwah, and the day of vengeance of our Elua, to comfort all that mourn, to appoint unto them that mourn in Zion, to give unto them beauty for ashes, the oil of joy for mourning, the garment of praise for the ruach of heaviness, that they might be called oaks of righteousness, the planting of Yahuwah, that he might be glorified. Also, as for the kabod of those who have now been justified in my Torah, who have had understanding in their life, and who have planted in their heart the root of wisdom, then their splendor shall be glorified in changes, and the form of their face shall be turned into the light of their beauty, that they may be able to acquire and receive the world which does not die, which is then promised to them. O Yashrael, return unto Yahuwah Elua, for you have fallen by your iniquity, taken with you words, and turn to all Yahuwah, say unto him, Take away all iniquity and receive us graciously. So will we render the calves of our lips. Ashishur shall not save us. We will not ride upon horses. Neither will we say any more to the work of our hands, ye are our Elohim. For in you the fatherless finds mercy. I will heal their backsliding. I will love them freely. For my anger is turned away from him. I will be as a dew unto Yashreel. He shall grow as a lily and cast forth his roots as Lebanon. His branches shall spread and his beauty shall be as the olive tree and his smell as Lebanon. And Yahuwah Elua shall save them in that day as the flock of his people. For they shall be as the stones of a crown lifted up as an ensign upon his land. For how great is his goodness, and how great is his beauty. Grain shall make the young men cheerful, and new wine the maid. One thing I have desired of Yahuwah, that will I seek after, that I may dwell in the house of Yahuwah all the days of my life, to behold the beauty of Yahuwah, and to inquire in his temple. Give unto Yahuwah the kapod do unto his name. Worship Yahuwah in the beauty of Kudasha. Out of Zion, the perfection of beauty, Yahuwah has shined. And let the beauty of Adoni Yahuwah be upon us and establish the work of our hands upon us. Yea, the work of our hands establish it. Honor and majesty are before him. Strength and beauty are in his sanctuary. O worship Yahuwah in the beauty of Kudasha. Fear before him all the earth. Favor is deceitful and beauty is vain. But a woman that fears Yahuwah, she shall be praised. I loved her above health and beauty and chose to have her instead of light. For the light that comes from her never goes out. As the sun, when it arises in the high heaven, so is the beauty of a good woman in the ordering of her house. And when he had consulted with the people, he appointed singers unto Yahuwah, and that should praise the beauty of Kudasha, as they went out before the army, and to say, Praise Yahuwah for his mercy endures forever. O Saba Yahuwah, I come before you and ask that you give us clean hands and a pure heart that we might ascend to your Kudash hill. I ask that you allow us to be able to worship you in Ruach and in truth, that we might behold the beauty 
of your kurasha. And we know that earthly beauty is temporary and all vanity. But we know that those who fear you shall be prayed. Instill in us your beauty, your character, and your way. And all these things I ask and I pray in the delegated authority of Yahushua HaMashiach. So be it.